Housing in Brighton is insanely expensive. There isn't really any way you can get a decent rent that is going to be covered in your student loan at all. You're still finding that landlords are treating students as disposable because they're there for nine months, they're transient. Like, how much can you challenge someone if you're only going to be there for a short length of time? The goals of the group are initially to find one property and start running it as a student cooperative with the aim to then build that project further in the city and build a student cooperative network. We really wanted a solid base of policies so that no matter who's coming in and out, because it's obviously student population is fairly transient, that we could keep with the same values and yeah, just really build that core. The, when it's set up, we want to really dedi be dedicated to sustainability, for example. Obviously, it's got a really strong community base. We've done training on like various different communication methods within like a community meeting and like looking at how we can really grow as a community. It should be a really innovative space. One of the biggest things that I've learned is patience. Anyone who's bought a house can tell you it takes it takes a long time. Like I think that almost makes it more worthwhile because it's something that has been really fought for. You know, you just gain so much from it. Like the people that I've met being involved with this project have all been amazing. And yeah, and I just think everyone brings something different. There's a couple of other projects up north that are just getting off. So we're hoping that the more people see student co-housing working, the more they're gonna look to it as a solution because obviously universities are battling with local populations all the time to try and find solutions because they just build expensive accommodation for their students and it really outprices people who are living there. Having students at the helm of it, I think is really exciting. And I think once people can see that working long term, that that really just takes off because we need change and hopefully <laughs> this is the start of it.